great it's been amazing surreal been feeling a lot of emotions but overall really exciting so far and just an ex amazing experience so far playing against uh, some of the top uh, defenders when last time up uh, how was it <laughs> um definitely a learning experience um, to be up against players that have been playing in the top leagues um, all around so definitely awesome to go up against that high level and to give myself a gauge of where I'm at as an attacker. Um, and everyone was just kind of saying it, it was a good good level to assess like where we are in our career so far and as a team and as a unit. So really good, really great learning experience so far. Personally, how would you assess uh, yourself in your performance? Uh, in the so far, I mean, I'm really proud of the way that we played our first mm -hmm. debutante match, um, kind of like Stadge was saying, um, he's very proud of us and I'm very proud of the showing that we were able to put out there to the world, to the Philippines. Um, so very proud and just a good showing, but obviously you know, we didn't get the result that we wanted. So moving forward, we want more. We're hungry for our first win and hopefully it could be against New Zealand. Sorry, you know you played New Zealand in last year. Um, that way, will, that, will that have an effect on how will you approach some good games? Yeah, definitely. I think we've got some knowledge already about them, how they play. Um, obviously, we're not going to know exactly what happens on the day, but we have a little bit of an advantage in knowing how they play, playing up against them. Um, so, And some of us have been playing in the Australian League, playing up against Kiwis as well. So um, we're ready, we're excited, and I feel like getting that first game done kind of has lifted like a weight off our shoulders and it, now we can be a little bit more relaxed going into still a tough opponent but um, we're ready and ready to attack it. Um, you're coming off a historic win um, that have an effect also on the game? Yeah, I think they're definitely going to come in confident after winning their first ever World Cup match um, which is not an easy thing to do and you know we're hoping we can get that first first win for us you know sooner rather than later but yeah they're definitely going to come in confident strong but we're definitely going to match that if not go go higher and uh, pass the expectations so, sorry you, know, you mentioned about uh, the emotions of playing the first game historic one for the country so could you please elaborate uh how was the feeling like uh, you know going to the pitch uh, singing the national anthem for the first time in a world cup stage uh, how was, yeah how was i mean like I said, it was surreal that that was actually happening. You know, as a kid, I dreamed of going to the World Cup and kind of set goals for myself. And for it to actually be a reality was just I'm speechless. I can't really put it into words how that felt. But um, I think even leading up before we actually stepped in and played the first match the day before, I had that moment of like, oh my gosh, it's real. When we're getting used to the familiarization, getting to the field, filling things out, you know, feeling the, t touching the grass, feeling it, walking around, like that's when it really hit me. And then fast forward to the match, um, you know, singing that national anthem with everyone and seeing the people in, this, in the stands, family, friends, it was just like, wow, this is, this is really happening. So speechless, but amazing. And it, it, it kind of felt all familiar also, as even though it was our first, my first time, the girls' first time, um, felt like we were exactly where we needed to be in that moment. When Katrina scored that goal that was nullified, how was, what was your reaction? Then? Oh, just jubilation, just <laughs> pure, ecstatic, so happy, but, you know, short-lived. It, <laughs> it was definitely off sides, wishing it was on, but um, just to even get that little taste of what it might feel like when we do square our first goal, um, I think makes us even more hungry to, to get yeah. it because we felt it for a little yeah, bit. Yeah. So uh, we want to be able to hold on to it and cherish it uh, for a while, for a long time. So we're hoping to get that. It's New Zealand. What was it like, you know, I know you belong in the World Cup, but scoring that goal against those, that uh, quality opponent, did it made you feel that, yes, we, are, we really do belong? Yeah, I think we really do belong. And like I said, it was short, mm -hmm. short-lived, but um, I really think we can do it. I think we can get our first goal and our debutant um, appearance in the World Cup. Um, I think we can get our first win as well here. Um, it's just going to take a lot of hard work grit, determination, trust, um, just a lot of different things that it's 
going to require from us, but we've been working on this for well over a year and a half now, and I know I know we can get the result. What's the World Cup exactly as you envisioned it? It surpassed. It surpassed um, my expectations. And how different are you before uh, before you played that first game and now? Still learning, still growing. I think I have more information than I did coming into it, even after that first game. Um, just learning from, you know, Bachman, Walti, um, just Gurchevich, watching them play and, you know, just seeing the confidence and the relaxation out there, just even learning as I was playing against them. So um, taking that all that in so that I can apply it into the next few games, but definitely a learning and growing experience so far. Are you more confident now as a player than Definitely. Than every day, every day working to be more confident. Uh, Sarina, um, before you played before partisan crowds, especially the singing, some um, Tuesday you play for many New Zealand fans, uh, will that be different or will this just will be the same? No different. I think even playing against Vietnam and yeah. Sea Games, that was probably the biggest crowd I had played in so far, and just to even get that experience of so many fans rooting against you is mm. good. It's good because, you know, we're going to go against the host nation, and it's going to be 10 times louder mm. and so much energy that's going to be against us. But, like, I think we're going to be fueled by that, and we're going to have our Filipinos and our supporters out there, too, that'll be just as loud. Mm -hmm. So, um, it's it's all, all the stuff that we prepared has brought us to this moment, and um, I have no doubt we'll do we'll do well.